Hey yo everybody, Escape211 here. We are looking at Disruptor 16 on the test server. I'm doing this with Gatecrasher. I will put my build up. Um, pretty much a top end build. Now I wasn't sure if I should run this on Gatecrasher or Scorpius or Onyx. Those are, those are I feel like the three that kind of make the most sense for this weapon. You know, just because those don't really have great defenses, but the low exposure is nice. I feel like Scorpius works well with like Helix, Onyx maybe more so Missile Rack 16, you know, so this felt like it would be good for Gatecrasher to kind of find a niche or a spot. Um, I've always liked the Disruptor. I think it's a really fun weapon. Uh, I think it's pretty balanced. I think it's very interesting. But, I mean, its performance has been a little under par for me. Now, when I got to the 16, I thought, all right, this is where the rubber meets the road, right? Where we can see if this is dealing enough damage for its shots because the projectile speed is low. And I feel like when I'm hitting max bots like this, it's still not outputting as much damage as I would like, especially given its projectile speed. Uh, so I do feel like it could kick up one of those slightly and do better. Um, not that it's doing bad. I mean, I've, I've been able to do pretty well with it. Um, I've been playing various matches. Sometimes I get snuck in by a shot with either EMs or railguns. My gosh, the Scorpius with the rail of uh, the EMs and the now the Nomads with the railguns on the test server are insane. So we'll see how I do here. Uh, but generally I've gotten like seven to nine ish kills, um, which isn't bad, but it's not like it's doing anything major. Um, you know, sometimes I die before that, but like if I'm going to last a match, uh, so we'll see how we do here. Um, but you know, it's, it's also kind of positionally or map dependent. Um, some maps where it's too open, you can't really get a good spot to kind of camp out like I'm doing here. Uh, other maps where there's not really good areas for like long lanes or areas where you can kind of command a position. It can also be tough. Works pretty well on this map because you're, you have three lanes and you're kind of funneled and into each where you can do well. Uh, but on other maps that can get really tricky. So uh, it, it is kind of dependent on that. You do have to pick your spots that are going to be the most efficient for this and then kind of play proactively for your shots down lanes and stuff like that. Um, you know, I mean, if you've already played Disruptor or seen other footage, you probably get, oh man, okay, you stunned. That was good. Just because that stinking nomad, that would have could have been the, oh man, here's another one. At least he's in the center. Maybe we can take him out doing these kind of peak shots. Yeah, yeah, yes looks like it all right awesome good oh my gosh there's another one holy crap come on dude okay good woof these dudes are are getting to me and once they see you and they're aggressive it's like goodbye you know because they'll zoom right in on you and uh because they have that um extra armor i don't do as much damage to them with this weapon um so they're very tricky to deal with i gotta i gotta be honest um but yeah i i think it's you know again not a bad build um i I do feel like it's a little bit below where we would say meta or top end, that kind of stuff. Um, as far as legendary goes, it's probably maybe on par with like minigun to grav beams. Probably a little below that, but that's that's about where it sits. I feel like it could use a little bit of a buff, like I said, either projectile speed or overall damage, especially because we're looking at the 16 and it still feels under power or uh, uh, under par. But yeah, that's just my overall thoughts. Um, I still really like the idea of the weapon, like I said, but, you know, you guys can let me know what you think. Do you think this, you know, works well enough as a uh, 16 energy or if it needs some changes, feel free to comment below what you think and we will see you out there on the battlefield.